How's it going, people? Well, we're getting through it. Oh, but first, there's really nothing to drink to, but I thought I'd have a red chair. I'm hoping it's good. Music is Piano Chocolate. Free download from jamindo.com. I'll, I'll supply a link. Chapter 5 of the Book of Moroni. Mode of administering the sacramental wine. That's right, they've already done the bread, didn't they? Yeah, they did the bread last time. One, the manner of administering the wine. Behold, they took the cup and said, to, O oh God, the Eternal Father, we ask thee in the name of thy Son, Jesus Christ, to bless and sanctify this wine to the souls of all those who drink of it, that they may do it in remembrance of the blood of thy Son, which was shed for them, that they may witness unto thee, O God, the Eternal Father, that they do always remember him, that they may have his Spirit to be with them. Amen. And that's it for five. Really not too much, huh? His last words, huh? Discipline. Yeah, I've seen some of that firsthand. One. And now I speak concerning baptism. Behold, elders, priests, and teachers were baptized. And they were not baptized, save they brought forth fruit, meat, that they were worthy of it. Two, neither did they receive any unto baptism, save they came forth with a broken heart and a, con and a contrite spirit, and witnessed unto the church that they truly repented of all their sins. were received at the baptism, see they took upon them the name of Christ. Having a determination to serve him to the end. Four, and after they had been received at the baptism, and were brought upon and cleansed by the power of the Holy Ghost, they were numbered among the people of the Church of Christ. And their names were taken that they might be remembered and nourished by the good word of God. To keep them in the right way, to keep them continually watchful unto prayer, relying alone upon the merits of Christ, who was the author and the finisher of their faith? And I thought it was Paul. I guess actually Joseph Smith Jr., really. Or was it Briggy? Yeah, Briggy Young. Five. Hang on. And the church did meet together oft. Too fast and to pray, and to speak 
one with, an, uh, with another, concerning the welfare of their souls. Oh, and that's supposed to be between A.D. 400 and, and A.D. 420 at the time of this writing. Yeah. Six. And they didn't meet together oft to partake of bread and wine in remembrance of the Lord Jesus. Seven. And they were strict to observe that there should be no iniquity among them. And whoso was found to commit iniquity, and three witnesses of the church did condemn them before the elders, and if they repented not and confessed not, their names were blotted out, and they were not numbered among the Church of Christ. Or they might get a, a registered letter from the LDS, like my sister did, as she had to sign for it. <laughs> They're like, you're blotted out. Three people talk smack. Yeah. Eight. And as oft as they repented and sought forgiveness, with real intent, they were forgiven. Nine. Their meetings were conducted by the church after the manner of the workings of the Spirit and by the power of the Holy Ghost. For as the power of the Holy Ghost led them whether to preach or to exhort or to pray or to supplicate or to sing. Even so it was done. And that's it for six, and I'm done too. <laughs> Anyhow, moving right along, we'll be done in no time. Uh, the chapters are going to get longer after this, so I don't need to double up <laughs> from now on. But I hope you learned something and that this is all worth it. Uh, let me know. Peace the fuck out. Have a wonderful whatever the fuck it is you're having. Bye.